hi guys welcome back to the channel um so just a little video of basically what i got today when i popped into my nearest city center so i live in a town in between two cities and then normally i work on a wednesday but my in-laws are on holiday so i i've got annual leave um so we caught the bus because the bus fares are capped at two pound at the minute and my eldest, who's four now, loves the bus. So does my youngest, to be fair. And it's so much cheaper than driving and parking. I'm actually... It's actually cheaper for me to drive to Birmingham, which is not that far. Probably like 45 minutes if I travelled on a day. Oh, my gosh. What's happened to this sign? Oh, it's meant to be like that. Sorry. It's that sign I brought you today. I've just seen these black dots. And I was like, oh, what's that? Um, It's meant to be like that. But, yeah, it... On a good run, it'd probably take me 45, 50 minutes to drive to Birmingham and it's still cheaper to park than my nearest city, which is Leicester. Well, Leicester and Coventry, I'm about equal distances, but Coventry is a nightmare to drive in. But anyway, digressing. So I just thought I'd show you everything I've got. I've got a bit from Primark, which is very small, but I'll include it in this, even though it's mainly food and stuff. So, oh gosh, the first place I went into was B&M. So they're doing Pringles for a pound at the minute. So I got these multi-grain barbecue sauce, sour cream and chilli, the original and the Texas barbecue. Um, just to put away for Christmas, might give a couple to the food bank. I'm still unsure. I also got this little Nerf gun for my dad. Um, so we're doing him loads of random bits and bobs for Christmas. And he loves my son's. Um, so this was, how much was this? I did keep all the receipts, but being him at the minute, I've got, a toy sale on so the two for 24 is two for 20 plus 10 percent off on top of that so these were actually reduced to five pounds and then with the 10 percent off they were four pound 50 and um, how i managed to sneak these without being seen i still don't know so i thought that was quite good it's quite big um yeah four pound 50 i thought that was good but this was meant to be what was it meant to be because I did have one in my Tesco food shop basket for, on the club card for £2, exactly the same. I think this was £2. I think it was £2 and then obviously you get the 10% off. But I don't know where the receipt's gone. Might be in my handbag, but yeah. So that's everything I've got from b &M. And then in Leicester, there's her hair and food, a small one, but it's normally quite good. And I'd, I'd seen a post saying they were doing all their Heinz deals again and last time i went i stocked up on loads of um they weren't heinz but they were like organic food pouches and they were like 39p each and i did a massive stock up and i've got through them now and um, they did have like some of the tubs that you make the food up but my youngest is one next week and he doesn't he prefers textures now so these were two for a pound um so i've got two of these my eldest used to love these so how, what's the date on these yeah so till march 2024 just as a backup just as an emergency um because he pretty much eats everything we eat whereas my eldest i really struggled to get him to eat what we ate when he was younger and i used to just buy these but they're so expensive now they're about two pound now and i never used to pay more than a pound so yeah I got those as a backup just to stock up the cupboard. This was also a bargain. Smooth organic peanut butter. What was this? Um, that was... Oh, 79p. It was marked up as 89 but... Yeah, oh. Um, also got these as bribery. We've already been tapped into as my youngest saying, Mama. Um, these were 79p. And then I saw these at the till. And I'm going to put... We're going to have one. Not me and my partner. Because I think they're individually wrapped. Yeah, and then I'm going to put one away for a Christmas present. And they were a pound each. Never seen them before. What's the date on them, actually? Um, oh, next year, October. I wish I'd have picked another one up. But I did just pop into another b and on my way home as we got off the bus um, where I live. And they have them in there as well for a pound. So, yeah, so I spent... What did I spend in heaven? Um, £5.58. So that was good. And then I popped into Aldi for coleslaw and chips. Forgot the chips, got the coleslaw, got a million other things. So I spent £21 dead on. This was £1.99 and these are new. So I've got this for work. I don't normally um, get anything like this. I always like batch cook. Uh, I say batch cook. I always cook something like spaghetti bolognese on a Tuesday. 
and do enough so I can take it to work. But this week's been a bit all over. So I just grabbed this um, to have because I know what I'm like. If I don't take anything, I just won't eat anything. Well, I, w I say I won't eat anything. I won't have time to pop out and eat anything. And I'll just eat crap um, from my snack drawer. So, yeah, that was one ninety nine. I also got for snowman lollies, they were one pound four. And um, the chicken five fillets, I don't need these until next week. Um, meal plan, and these were on offer for four ninety nine. They're normally five pounds something, so I thought I'm getting them now because what I was going to do get the coleslaw, then pop back in Friday and get all the other bits. And I thought, you know what, I can't be bothered with it. Um, I also picked up two stuffings again whilst I could get them. These were one pound forty nine each. They didn't have a price, but yeah, one pound forty nine. I should have just got the one, but I didn't. Um, the cranberry sauce. This was fifty. I want to say fifty five p or fifty seven p because I did check it against the one I had in my basket, the Tesco's own brand, and that's sixty five p. It's meant to be sixty five p, but it was like five ten p cheaper, so I got it. Um, and the what was the other one I had in my basket? um oh horseradish but that was the same price so i've just left that in my basket um got some chocolate spread one pound 15 not sure what this one's like it's just for my eldest sandwiches that's the only thing you need in sandwiches the bagels there 89p um also got two packs of sweets these were on offer for 42p i can remember they were like 28p like picked up some like pick and mix bags and i'm sure they used to be 30 odd p let's come though they were like 78p and i was like no i don't want them anymore i'll um get them elsewhere but yeah madness for a small bag of sweets i thought i can go to the pound shop and get a big bag um brochy buns for burgers at the weekend chicken burgers these were 99p on offer um again i got conned <laughs> into buying my eldest this just to bribe him around the shop i think i don't know how much it was 70 odd p and um, also got these cheese bakes for my youngest to try i thought he'd quite like them as a little snack not the whole packet obviously but a few at a time these were 79 p i think um and the coleslaw i don't know how much it was one pound something but the dates are always crap basically on them and my partner's really funny about coleslaw. I mean, I don't have a preference personally. Um, so I always try and get it as close to when we're going to have it. He always has it on his pizza, which is pizza night tonight. Um, so, yeah, I went in and got that. So, that, yeah, that all came to £21. And then next, I'll show you what I got from Primark, which wasn't a lot, to be fair. Um, but I am I'm going for a blood test on Monday. Um and there's a Primark near where I'm going, so I'm hoping that one will be a bit better. Um, yeah, I also got these two of these bags to put my niece's Christmas presents in, and they were a pound each from the works. Um, so yeah, I got some new pajamas. They're all entangled up. But these were fifteen pounds. But I've <laughs> I will wear these till death. And I had a voucher to be fair. But yeah, I, I brought. I basically. Um, my friend shared it in our group about um, like a budget saving mum I think her name is on Instagram about buying the Primark tops and then using pyjama bottoms what you've already got for your children so I've got them for the boys but then I was like oh I really want a new pair of pyjamas anyway I'll wear them all year round and I love them and I thought oh I could utilise them at Christmas as well um, but yeah that's what I got and then I got my niece an outfit for Christmas who is eight um, she's very tall and very skinny, but if I, I've found if I size up, everything's just too big. Not so much the tops, but the bottoms definitely are. So I've got this cute top. I love it. And it says, good times, black and white monochrome, 89. And how much was that? £2.80. I mean, you can't go wrong. Hello. I've got a little helper. Um, and then these lovely leggings as well. These were £3. And I thought they're just nicer than your standard leggings because I've got a all the standard ones for a birthday every colour you can get a lot i then got this bag so i love the bag i brought um from primark and i think it was seven pound but i prefer a tan handbag because it just goes with everything and it's pleather and i was like i need it eight pound um love that i also got two pillowcases to match our new bedding they were two pound 
and then I also got some pajamas again my eldest had a voucher as well that he got for his birthday from one of his friends and he needed some pajamas I have sized up in these in five to six I thought I picked up four to five but at least they'll last but he's just started martial arts and he's like oh they're martial arts pajamas mummy because I'm, I'm tracking on um but yeah you get two pairs in there but it was really it was like bedlam at the pajamas, especially the boys' ones today. Oh, I just couldn't get close to anything. And I was like, you know what? I'm just grabbing and I'm going. So I'm hoping when I go Monday, because it'll be earlier. Um, what are you doing with my shopping? I'll be able to probably get another pair because they've still got some money left. And then I found these in the bottom of the bag. These are 125 everywhere at the minute. Again, can remember when they were a pound. Or well, two for a pound in the pound shop. And the pound shop is near the bus station, so I just picked them up. Oh, and some birthday candles for my baby's birthday next week because the stash I've got is gone with all the birthdays we've had recently. But yeah, that's everything I've got. Sorry, it's a bit of a mismatchy haul, guys. Um, but yeah, I like to see what people get when they shop. And I, it was hectic with the two children. Oh, I've got all my receipts now. Um, I'm just trying to find the B&M one. No, that's the Aldi one. What did I spend in Aldi? Was I right? £21. Let's have a look. Yeah, dead on twenty one pound. I'm not sure where the B and M one. Yeah, I'm not sure where the B and M one is, but yeah. Um, so I hope you enjoy. Uh, like I say, I'm going to go to another Primark next week and hopefully get a bit more. Um, if I do, I'll obviously film it. If I don't, excuse me, you're squashing all my washing. Um, all my washing. <laughs> That's what I normally say. Squashing all the food. Um. But yeah, I'll record it if I do. But don't forget to like and subscribe. And my mind's gone blank. So when am I back? Oh, I've got... What have I got upload? Oh, my, I've got a home bargains haul coming Saturday. And then I'll fit this in somewhere because it's going to be quite a short one. And then um, weekly food shop. I'm going to start uploading on a Monday rather than a Tuesday. Um, so that'll be on on Monday. But hope you all have a good week or you've had a good week so far and take care don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye guys say bye bye as i'm putting the shopping away i forgot we got this as well sleepy bear bath bomb from lush so my eldest loves a bath bomb and we normally buy them from primark oh, this camera never focus um from primark and places like that but this is going to be a special christmas eve one for him and his brother um, but they were just so expensive. I know Lush is expensive anyway, but I, he picked one up and it was like eight pound. I was like, no, you know, um, it's just for the novelty at the minute. He doesn't really appreciate the fact it's from Lush, but this was three pound seventy five, um, and I wanted like a milky one because his brother's got really, they've both got sensitive skin, but um, I didn't want one with all glitter and things in. So yeah, I got that as well. Um, certainly going to be a once a year purchase they did have some lovely stuff in there but it just it's just a lot of money right another clip to add in again sorry for the background noise jojo and grand grand's on so we've actually popped to another home bargain uh, home bargains b and m because we've just had a big one open near us and i'm part of like a local mum group as we call it and this lady had shared that she'd just been down and got some real bargains. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to dash down and see what I can get. And I got the, this. So I'm actually thinking the little one that you would have seen earlier, I paid £3, 10% off, 30p, so £2.70. When I got this for £5. So I'm thinking of returning that and giving this to my dad because of the targets and stuff. Um... But yeah, I couldn't leave it for £5. And then I got this one. It wasn't even marked down, as you can see. Still £15, 2 for 24 And I scanned it on the app and it was £5. And I know, like, Mayor of Guns, hello, a controversial. But my lad will love that. But then I'm like, two is very excessive. So I'm actually going to give this one to my dad. Um, but yeah, when I went to the... Other than them, how much did I spend? So nineteen pounds sixty-eight. So I got those two goods. So that was ten pound. I also got a pack of three. Let me show you. A pack of three um, 
photo frames for 1.99 i just put pictures in them i also got this to put away for christmas for my youngest just a bath toy because he loves the bath see that full price is four pounds so on the receipt it doesn't actually it just gives the discount over all this focuses so it was meant to be hold on 90 pound 68 and one pound 40 was taken off for the toys so and i also got some beef dripping at one pound 19 um, and some baubles that were reduced to two pound fifty. They're meant to be a fiver. I'm not sure where they've gone now. So, yeah, three different B and M's today, which is very. Oh, this camera really does look at it very excessive, considering it's the newest iPhone. It's really not great.